Hey guys, uh, I'm Ethan Moore from Stockroom Supply. Um, I was communicating with Frank on email who has one of these 10 inch Rycom bandsaws. This is a beautiful little machine, but he is struggling with it because he keeps breaking blades. Now, first thing that I ask him is, what kind of blade is he using? Now he's using something that he bought that they call a wood turner band. So wood turner band is a little bit extra wide, a little bit extra kerf on that blade, so it's a little thicker. Now, on a bandsaw, like a 14 inch bandsaw like this, that thicker blade is fine on that 14 inch diameter wheel, where that blade for wood turners, often they are advertised as 0 .032 inches wide. That's how wide it is right here. So quite beefy. Now that's great because it'll clear the chips when you're dealing with wet wood and all sorts of things like that. Now, and honestly, that blade is my favorite blade. I love it. But if we go over to a smaller bandsaw like this, you see the smaller diameter wheel here. On that thicker blade, it's not as flexible as a thinner blade would be. So when you're trying to wrap that around a 10 inch diameter wheel, it will break quite easily because of the extra stress you're putting rounding the corner there. Um, so on a 10 inch bandsaw, I would always recommend you um, get a 0 0.025 inch wide blade. Um, on this saw, actually right now, what comes with it is a 0 0.022 or 22 inch wide blade. Um, that's how thick the blade is here. Um, so yeah, we would never sell one that wide, but we definitely recommend the smaller ones. Now, if we go a step further, and this, these bandsaws are really common, they're really, because they're really cheap, especially to buy used, a three wheel bandsaw. A lot of you guys may own one of these because you sometimes can pick them up for 20, 30 bucks. They're, they're inexpensive. Um, but the reason they're inexpensive is nobody really likes them because they break blades like crazy. So if you look at the diameter of the wheel, this is 10 inch. On these three wheel bandsaws, oftentimes they're six inch or less. They're quite small diameter. So when you're trying to wrap a blade around that wheel, again, you're putting even more stress on it. So we sell a special blade specifically for these three wheel bandsaws and it is 0 0.02 inches wide um, so quite thin but they won't snap and they won't break and they work really really well on these machines um, so yeah they're called a three wheel flexible back um, the blade for this one yeah you're not going to go any you're not going to want to go with a 0 0.032 inch wide blade which is often advertised as a wood turner band uh, we sell it as a furniture band. It's honestly my favorite blade. If you have a bigger saw like this, a 14 inch band saw, go with that blade because it's great, um, I think. But if you have a smaller one, we have lots of other blades that we could recommend you would use that you won't have to worry about breaking quite so easy. So yeah, if anybody else has any questions, you can email me at info at stockroomsupply.com or just comment on the video. Now, if you want to see future videos, make sure you subscribe and hit the little bell button because that will alert you when a new video is posted. And also add us on uh, Instagram. Thank you much.